third round of the 2011 Greenbrier Classic. The old white TPC course in White Sulphur Springs, West Virginia. Two at the top at the halfway point at seven under par. Who would make their mark in the third round? Moving day for Jimmy Walker as he cards a 62 in soft conditions, very little wind, and he makes a big climb 56 spots up the leaderboard. 36-hole leader alongside Brendan DeYoung was Webb Simpson. And at one point, he was one over in his round with three bogeys on the card. Midway through, he was trying to find success, but he does find it late. Birdie at the par 5, 17th. He would add another at 18. So Simpson sharing third on the leaderboard right alongside Gary Woodland. And this an early birdie for Woodland. He would open with a pair at the first and second. He would make the turn in one under, adding another at 13. And this short one at 17 in Woodland. In with a 67 and a share of third, looking for his second win of 2011. He can climb into the top 10 in FedEx Cup points if he is in position to win on Sunday. Scott Stallings is also gearing up for what could be a momentous Sunday, looking for his first win on tour. A bogey-free 66 for Stallings. Chasing now our 54-hole leader, Anthony Kim. And Kim at the 14th in tight. A kick-in birdie there. Anthony with four birdies over his first five holes on the back nine, adding another at 17. And he matches Walker with a Saturday 62. And he leads by a shot heading into the final round. Missing birdie at 18 for that 61, but still a 62 on the card and the advantage heading for the final round. Join us 1 o'clock Eastern on Golf Channel, early final round coverage, followed by CBS at 3 o'clock.